Hello guys, welcome back. In this video, let's talk about Flutter block pattern implementation with examples. First, I will introduce Flutter block core concepts. And then, let's dive into coding part. If you are new to block pattern and don't know anything, don't worry. You will learn zero to hero after watching this video. So stay tuned. Let's get started. What is Flutter Block? Flutter Block is one of the state management library for Flutter applications. You can use it to handle all the possible states of your application in an easy way. Block means business logic component. The goal of this package is to make it easy to implement the block design pattern. This design pattern helps to separate presentation from business logic. Following the block pattern facilitates testability and reusability. When we talk about block, we have to learn event and state. So what is event and what is state? Okay, let me explain. Think about this example. If the user opens the app and clicks the button to get the data, then we can call that click event as block event to get data. Here is another example. Think about the shopping app. When the user clicks the categories button and gets all categories, we can identify that event as an event. I mean block event. Then what is state? State is the output of block. I mean, when the state changed UI components, we'll get the notification and based on the current state it can re-render itself. Think about the previous example. When the user click button, mobile app UI will display progress indicator. And when the data loaded, the user will see loaded data. So we can call the data loading state as a block state. Also data loaded state as block state. Also, if the data fetch failed, user will see error UI. Then we can identify data fetch failed state as block state. So user will see user interfaces according to block states and events. Did you get my point? If you do not understand, don't worry. You will learn more in the coding section. In the next chapter, we will discuss block widgets. So, stay tuned. 